Ladies and gentlemen, Herbert Butler is here. Today's subject is the great Western star, Randolph Scott. Uh, did he get killed in several films, Herbert? Well, as I uh, look back on his career, Randolph Scott, born in Virginia in 1898, came out here to uh, Hollywood uh, to make films um, under the influence of uh, Howard Hughes helped him to get into films. He went to the, Randy went to the uh, Pasadena Playhouse to get some experience and then uh, soon Hollywood discovered him and used him in Western movies and other films too, comedies as well as war movies. Randy got killed in about four films that he had made. Uh, the first one was The Virginia City. Um, with Humphrey Bogart, Earl Flynn, and Marion Hopkins. Um, in this film, he was a rebel uh, from the South, and uh, somehow they were able to get a, a, a big supply of gold. And so they brought that out to um, Nevada, in Virginia City in Nevada. And uh, so he was killed uh, fighting against uh, rebels who were trying to steal the gold from them. The other films he was killed in was called Bombardier, a war movie, Second World War movie. Western Union was the story of the uh, telegraph, uh, history of the telegraph in the West. And of course the last movie he may had made uh, where he was killed in was uh, the Doolins of Oklahoma. As an outlaw, he was shot down by the sheriff's people. That's just great. I love hearing this. He's one of my favorite actors also. Herbert Butler, ladies and gentlemen.